Good evening to all my wonderful viewers out there and welcome back to another Sneaker Talk video. The series where I discuss the latest sneaker releases, I discuss the latest sneaker news, and of course in the series, well, we just discuss anything to do with boots, sneakers, or really any kind of footwear. What I'm going to be talking about today is everything to do with an upcoming collaborative release. What I'm gonna be covering is everything to do with the Palace Skateboards and Crocs collaboration that they are doing for week two of Palace's Autumn 2023 collection. Hey, you heard me right, guys. Fresh off their first release of the Autumn 2023 season, Palace is coming back for a collaborative second week and as kind of mentioned in that intro, they are collaborating with Crocs. And in today's video, well, as also the intro mentioned, we're going to be covering everything to do with that. <laughs> uh, we'll be covering the release details, all the individual images, all the photos and colorways that this collaboration is coming in. And of course, I'll speak my mind about it and talk about how I feel about the whole collab. Uh, how we're going to cover all those details is like we always do by using a Hype Beast article. We'll head on over to that article now and we'll start covering the release details for this week two collab. So here we are at the Hype Beast article that we're gonna be using today, guys. If you wanna check it out for yourselves, as I always do, I'll link it down in the description section below for you guys to check out. We'll scroll past all this awesome, informative information and just talk about the release details for this week two collab. So, Palace Fall 2023 Week 2 drop is set for both in-store and online releases starting August 11th, which if today's date, which is Tuesday the 8th, Wednesday the 9th, Thursday the 10th, Friday the 11th, yeah, that checks out. It'll be releasing on uh, Palace's online store on that Friday, but also at Dover Street Market, Los Angeles and London as well. Uh, the rest of the week to drop, as showcased here, will be releasing in Japan on August 12th, so the Saturday. Uh, it'll be releasing in-store and online, 11 a.m. Japanese Standard Time. And if you want to pick it up in China, it will be dropping on the WeChat store, Palace underscore Skateboards, uh, on the same day that Japan gets it, which is August 12th, 11 a.m. Chinese Standard Time. Now, it looks like there is also an extra release detail here. Uh, following this, Crocs is set to launch the collaborative Mellow Clogs on August 15th. So we might actually only be getting these for specifically week two, and these might come a little bit later. Now, the 15th isn't a whole week after that, uh, after the 11th. So I feel like we're not getting it for week three. We're kind of getting it halfway through. So I think I would still class it as a week two collab, but that's just something to keep in mind. Um, I don't know if they're both going to be releasing on the 11th on just Palace's store, and then a re-release of the Mellow ones is coming on the Crocs's store on the 15th. Um, I guess be there on the Friday um, with the hopes that this pair will release then. But if you want this pair, I'd be there on Friday just in case. But if it's anything like the release details are saying here, it might be releasing a little bit later there on exclusively on Crocs store. We'll have to see. Now, they're only making reference to two colorways, so maybe we're only getting two colorways. But um, we'll dive through the six images here that we have and we'll kind of see what we're getting and see if it is just these two colorways that are coming out. Here is the, again, I think it's two colorways that we are getting for this week to collab. We'll quickly just go on through the images and see if that's the case or not. Okay, going off the six images, it looks like that is confirmed. We are only getting those two colorways, but I did also want to highlight that the photos that they've taken professionally of these images are actually, I would at least say, quite different from how the product actually looks once you get it in hand. Because as we can see here, these are all the very glamorous photos. But then I think this is a more realistic look on what we're actually going to be getting and showcased here as well. Because look how bright and fantastic the lighting is on this photo. But I feel like this is a lot more real. This is actually how it looks. So just setting expectations, I guess. And mo more so with this. How do I feel about the collaboration? Look, okay, when I heard that Palace and Crocs were collaborating, my first thought was, okay, it's just going to tick all the boxes of a generic collab, 
It's going to be the Crocs model with a bunch of palace motifs slapped on it and maybe a couple of those thingy-mabobbies to fill in the holes on the croc and those uh, little thingy-mabobbies are going to be the motifs from this autumn season in all honesty if they did exactly that i was i'd be like yeah this is exactly what i expected but seeing what we actually got it isn't what I was expecting, and I'm actually kind of happy to say that that's the case. I actually quite like the idea that what we got is not what I was expecting. How do I feel about what we actually got, though? Um, It's okay. I guess the main deterrent that I have is that it's, one, not a silhouette that I would wear, and two, the colors aren't very versatile and wouldn't work too well with my wardrobe. So I don't think it's just speaking volumes to me because it's just not something that I could see myself wearing. But I know a lot of people like wearing Crocs um, ironically and unironically. Um, so maybe this will appeal to you as just like a fun collaborative thing that you can rock for like a outfit where you're going down to the store to buy bread or something. Or maybe you legitimately want to wear it as a shoe in an outfit. I don't know. Each to their own i suppose but i just can't see myself doing more than wearing these for exactly what i just detailed going down to the store and buying bread <laughs> i just couldn't see myself rocking something like this like you know i'll pull them up from off the floor now like i'm definitely rocking boots and things more so these days because i'm working you know um monday to friday so I just can't, I can see Crocs just not coming into it for me a lot, but, um, you know, maybe this would be more your jam. Maybe you're more of a fan of this than I am. Um, I, I, I just think it's okay. You know, we got to dive into the details, a palace logo that kind of goes along with the overall pattern. We've got this green color and a brown color here. Um, it's not the traditional Croc silhouette, which, uh, you know, I think that's cool that they chose a different silhouette for it, but yeah. And then we've got the Trifog logo showcased here. Um, but yeah, like I'm, I'm going to be happy moving on with my life after this collaboration. And I feel like this is just very much a, okay, that's kind of cool for week two. Uh, I am just, I guess, happy that they didn't go to what I thought the collab was going to be. And they, um, you know, went outside there, I guess, um, my expectations a bit they went outside my expectations so i'm happy with that but all in all i'm not phased by this i'm not amazed by it maybe you feel differently um that's all i've really got to say about it in all honesty but i'd love to hear your guys thoughts on it you know maybe you're really keen on this collaboration maybe you think it's the best one yet or maybe you're just like me and you're just like it's whatever. <laughs> hey, look, whatever you've got to say about it, you know, maybe it's a yes, maybe it's a no. Let me know what your thoughts are on this collaboration down in that comment section below. And that's all I've really got to cover to do with this collaboration, guys. We covered the release details. It's dropping this Friday, August 11th. From what I gauge from the release details, that's probably the, going to be the release of the brown pair, while the mellow pair is coming on the 15th. But I would still just check back on the Friday on Palace uh, Skateboards just to see if they both release there. If not, definitely follow that 11th and then 15th for the two different drop times. Uh, we covered all the colors. We covered my thoughts on it. Um, again, cool that they went outside my expectations of what we were going to get. What we actually got still, though, it didn't blow me away. But it was cool that they, I guess, went out there a little bit. Um, I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts on it. And also, I'd love to hear if you guys are going to be picking it up at all. Are you feeling this collaboration? Or are you feeling what I thought was going to be the collaboration more? I'd love to hear your take on it. Let me know if you're going to be picking it up or not down in that comment section below. And of course, if you guys want to keep covering upcoming Palace releases, upcoming Palace collabs, and the week two drop list, you got to give me the three indicators I always ask you for, which is a like on this video, a comment in that comment section down below. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. As mentioned in previous uploads, we're trying to hit the new subscriber milestone of 3,670 subs before the end of the month. Hopefully with your guys' continuous support, we can reach 3670 before the end of the month. But that is everything I got to say about the uh, Palace Crocs collaboration releasing for week two. Stay tuned for the drop list video as that will be coming quite shortly as well. And yeah, until that next Palace video, until the next Sneaker Talk video, until the next drop list video in general, guys, 
I'll catch you later.